Mike is on. Good. Hello, everybody. Hello. This is Sarah Z. We are back with part seven. We are part seven now of Nine Souls. Uh, yeah, we're with a, looking at a back third here with the uh, progress on the bar down there, which I'm assuming is just progress on the database itself. But still, uh, we are five souls in. Uh, we beat Legacy. We beat Equality. We uh, enlisted Loyalty. Uh, we beat Discipline. And we uh, beat Benevolence. So uh, last five... Tenants of the Council, Justice, Innovation, Selflessness, Knowledge, and Insight. Uh, I wonder which one uh, G here is. Probably Knowledge, but we'll... Uh, or maybe it's Insight, because he is the blind one. Regardless, we are currently hanging out in the Grotto of Scriptures. Uh, the blind dude who kept showing up uh, around here is G, one of the souls. So we are ready to go back in and uh, find him. So let's see, we have, uh, we did do this door over here. So now we have two ways to go west, I think. So I am closer to the one that's lower. So that's what I'm gonna pick. Oof. Come on then, somebody take a shot at me. I gotta get back into practice here. It's only so... I can't only do this so long before it gets embarrassing. Although I, everyone does love watching me have little brain farts. Oh, I thought that was a falling whatever. Okay, got my extra skill. And now let's go to the west. See what's over here. Hello, Devel. Hello, JinBR. Thank you for joining the show. We are now in... Grotto Scriptures West. Yeah, I don't think we're crossing that anytime. Oh, that's gonna crash into the the ceiling below. I just gotta send it down. Or it could just be a regular old elevator. Yeah, it's a slow moving elevator too, no less. Fancy. Can I, uh... I guess I can, huh? Thought I could hop on this. Seems to have a top, but perhaps that is... A misdirection. Alright, so let's go back up and check on some of these other places we can go. So we can go beneath us. Let's check that out first. Fighting. Ooh. What the? Oh my gosh! Interesting. Interesting and difficult. It's funny because I meant to do an unbounded counter on that arrow, and instead I get. Hit by both. Let's try this again, sir. Hello. And that don't kill him. So it's best just to dodge at this point. <laughs> For the standard components. Really worth it. Too, super totally worth it. Okay, that's the... Whoop. Oh, whatever. Come on, dude. Let's see if I can... Huh, doesn't work. Why doesn't that work? Am I a fool? Ah, oh, crap. Do I have to air dash through it or something? That doesn't make any sense. Maybe I have to air dash through it. We'll try that next time, I guess. Oh, excuse me. I see. 
So I hit one of the, uh, I guess I activated one of the statues over here recently, so now we got little lights flowing. Uh, let's see, what kind of arrow do I like? I do like the Pearson one. I've always liked the Pearson one because it can go through shields and uh, can hit a bunch of enemies at once. The uh, Thunder one's pretty cool too. There. I was gonna use it. <laughs> I was gonna get back into doing talismans, but that's gonna that's gonna break. I knew it. So maybe I just gotta air dash through it, huh? That's not the guy, though. Definitely gotta get back into practice here. Okay. This is a transport that takes me to elsewhere. Okay. Let's see where it takes me, and then we'll just go back. <laughs> if it takes me to a brand new zone. Hmm. Which is likely. Okay, what's the one we got here? We are in the Empyrean District. Ooh, sounds fancy. Uh, that's as far as we're gonna go, though. Ooh, got cool music, too. Looking forward to that. Okay, so that area is through some kind of passage door, which could be anywhere, quite frankly. Uh, let's see. Up was blocked. That was blocked. So I guess the only other way is to go back to the east and then up. So we'll head back to the uh, root node. That's it, right? Yeah, because if I go down here, there's just a door being blocked. Cool. Neat. <laughs> we can't go up here. I mean, we can, but it's like... There's another door here. It seems like there's doors everywhere. And that's a retracted rope. Alright. Fair deal. Let's go back to the root node, have a seat, have a rest. Hopefully we don't get rolled over by a giant boulder again. Haha, <laughs> that was hilarious. And this time we'll go up and to the left. So best path there is straight to left to the door that's over there. That'll carry me further. Dang it. All oh, right. Can't until I break the shield. That's cool. Right, these guys. Can't believe I forgot about them already. Come on, then. Poof. I guess I can only do a maximum of three charges spent, which I guess is okay. It means I can do multiple talismans at once, or rather multiple talents in succession. And let's see, I think we're fine. We just want to go up and to the left. There's also an up and to the right. I forgot. That might be a blocked off door, though. We'll check. Oh. Dang it. Pick on the wrong moves here. Whew. Hi, Herbalife. Thank you for joining. By the way, I have to keep going down here because this is a shield generator here. There we go. Yep, that uses my drone to open the door. I'm sorry, my mystic nymph. I have to say it now because it's probably the soul of my sister. Yeah, another door that's blocked. A lot of shortcuts here. A lot of shortcuts. And then we just go west here, yeah. And we already took care of that. Oh, the rock's still there, actually. But that's okay. Keep moving. What? Aha! Uh -huh. Woo! Is G here? Or am I just gonna get stricken by the illness again? Ah! A little bit of respect. How are you doing, dear brother? Peace Day is coming up. Lear Day is also coming up. The few of us still around are planning to celebrate the festival as usual. 
I visited a few of our neighbors and discovered something. Those that have lost more family members tend to present more abundant offerings. Fortunately, our meals have always been simple, so I don't have to worry much. Thanks to the peach tree Dad planted when you were born, we were able to make sweet peach blossom wine almost every year. <laughs> Four dishes, one soup, and a bottle of fine wine. A meal for the whole family. Oh. There's Mom and Dad, I'm assuming. Enough. We won't ch enough. We won't change our minds. Nor will we. We're not going with you. Neither will Hung. Don't you ever put her in harm's way again. Wasn't the last time trouble enough? Honey, wait. <sighs> Why can't we have an exchange that lasts more than a minute? You should really know better at your age. Stop being so stubborn with your mother. Yep. Are you leaving, Yi? Won't you stay for dinner? Were you listening? I didn't hear everything, but I got the gist, more or less. I doubt any of us will be able to eat dinner without spitting it back out in another quarrel. <laughs> <laughs> Don't be upset. Today is a day of celebration. Thought Lear Day was next month. Hmm? Not that. They finally made you a Sol after all the years you put into the council. Isn't that worthy of a big celebration? Okay. 100% confirmation that uh, Ye is a Sol. Forget it. Not something to celebrate as far as Mom and Dad are concerned. They won't even listen to my plans. The entire world is desperate for a space on the island. With a town, town wall upon us, why would anyone choose to stay and await death? Mm. Mm. There's a group of Taoists who believe that we should accept this arrangement and return to Peng Lai's soil. <laughs> huh. Those Taoists are just a bunch of deluded fan fanatics. Maybe, but it's been our faith since the era of peace began. You believe science is the answer, but for others, inaction is the truth. Truth? The Fengxi Guild started off as a scientific organization. Lear was a scientist long before all this superstitious Taoist drivel. Forget it. Trust me, one day you will all understand. With my plan, I will not only ensure our survival, but also create a new paradise. Of course, I've oh always gosh. believed in you, Yi. But all that aside, are you not really staying? Are you really not staying? Remember the peach blossom wine we made last year? I waited a whole year just for a chance to try it with you. We'll do that next time. My mentor's waiting on my report, so I have to hurry back. We're in a race against time right now. Really? When's next time? Just, uh, soon. That won't be long. Take good care of yourself, and help me convince Mom and Dad. Mm. Okay, then I'll keep the wine sealed. We'll try it when you come back next time. So this is post Yi making his uh, mystic nymph and getting his, his ass blown. <laughs> his ass blowing out his air holes. That batch of wine is still sealed. Who knows for how many years now. Our yard is always strewn with flower petals during this time of year. If the four of us could sit together again under the peach tree in the yard, drinking wine as we chat about this and that, I'm sure it wouldn't be that far off from your paradise. See, I was actually concerned that uh, Hung gave her life or her soul to the... Uh, the facade to uh, get me healed up, but uh, I guess that didn't happen. I guess she was alive and well uh, for a time. Oh dear! Oh, is this happening? Here we go! Yeah, you uh, you deal with that. Okay, another root node. Cool. Well, it wasn't as embarrassing as last time. Thank goodness. Alright, we got a locked door over here that I can only open with uh, the drone. And down here, I guess, well, there's either this or the or bullet right beneath me where the, the boulder fell. Yeah, let's go down there first. Why not? Without impaling ourselves on the boulder itself, of course, because that's instant death, apparently, around this, that, these parts. Huh, hmm. Alright. Let's quick check over here, because this might just be a connector. Yeah, it really is. There's nothing over here. <laughs> it's interesting. Fight. Fight. No, no fight. Hello? Door? 
Oh. Okay, here we go. Welcome to Puzzle Central over here, and I just realized I can't get back up. Nope, actually I can stick to the wall, it's fine. Let's go over here and up here. Hello! Okay, uh, we got a door here. Let's check it out. Door leads to here. Where is here? Comparatively. Okay. Um, why do I feel like I'm disconnected here? I guess... No, no, no. I'm, I'm just up above all this now. No, I'm, I am disconnected. Because... <laughs> Okay, the rock was released from here, and it knocked down these rocks here. Got it. I'm just all discombobulated because the uh, of the trap earlier. Neat. Oh, Shadowman. Oh, criminy! They're shooting doubles at me now. Oh, great. Okay, you die, thank you. And then there should be a ground dude who's trying to get my number over here. Okay, you dead. Now me over here, and hopefully we can get this guy. Nice. Okay. Minimal damage or embarrassment. Okay, that leads me back down. Let me continue to the left. Meanwhile, this fella. Okay, another. Not quite. Yeah, these passage doors confuse me a lot. <laughs> Alright, so let's drop this. And before we reorient the walls, let's um, see if we can go down from here. Ow. Noted. Oh, crap. Not while I'm injured. First things first. <laughs> Yeah, you go first. So now I don't feel like I'm dealing with three guys. Neat! Alright, that door is where? <laughs> oh, it's right at the elevator. Cool. We get oh, we get to try our luck against this spell again. Ow. Well, that's obvious. Okay, let's see if I can air dash through this. Yes! Okay, so we just have to not screw that air dash up, is all. Good. Good information. Needed that. Alright, uh, things turn this way, things turn that way. Let's see. There's a hole here. The door's there. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. That leads to right... So if I just uh, reorient these for a second, I should be able to get... That rope dropped. This rope right here. Which just leads back again to the elevator. So, okay, how we do, how we do. So if I did this instead... Oops, I can only... Oh, you can only hit these once. Neat. Well, they're right next to each other, so it doesn't really matter that much, but... Did I go down left? Let's see if I went down left. Probably not. I think I just went straight up and that was it. Okay, now we go here. Which confusingly leads me here. 
which we've already cleared. Cool. So now let's see. Oh, uh, hang on. I gotta find a way back and around. Let's see. So I can't go back to the left because that's all blocked now. I mean, if I left, found a root node, and then teleported back there, I probably could make it. But I don't know if that's I don't know if that's what it wants or not. Eh. Are you sure I can't get up here anyway? I guess not. Nope, can't do it. Can't do it. You can't do it, so give up now. What you gonna do when your dough runs out? Okay, so that, if I take that here. And this leads me back over here. But that's as far as it goes, right? Because I can only go back out and loop around really in other weird ways. So. Let's walk back. Here. And should we reset the things to horizontal? Let's try that for, for right now. So let me think. If I go... There's no, like, uh, place where I can drop that, huh? No, I guess not. Yep, and that's a drone lock. There's the door where I need to go to find the next sage dude, I'm guessing. Of sorts, but I can't go any further back here. Let's see, so... I guess we can do it the quote-unquote easy way and just, uh... Because really what I want to get to right now is up here. And the only way I can see that happening is warping with a root node. So we'll try it. We'll see what happens. I think the nearest root node is the next next town over over here. Yeah, that's close enough, I suppose. Actually, I'm going to be one right below me, too. There is. There is one right below me. Okay, cool. What if I just dropped entirely? Whee! Okay, <laughs> I guess I didn't want me doing that. Noted! I was prevented from doing that. You know it'd be real funny. It'd be real funny if I went back to that root node and it's and it reset the things to horizontal. Cause that'd imply that I, Oh Well look what I found. Oops. Ow. Yeah, that's a rock that fell through there ages ago. Ooh, the Chi Blade Jade consumes t two Chi charges on the third hit of the Triple Slash to inflict much higher damage. Hmm. That sounds something. And this puts me up here, right next to the elevator. <laughs> Convenient. So that's that area completely tossed, I think. I'll know for sure once I find the, uh, the Shanghai robot, but... Okay, so I want to go down into the left. Here I am thinking to myself, how am I going to crash through this ceiling here? Turns out I'd already done it, just had forgotten. <laughs> hey guys. So. What's going on? Why are you staring at the portrait? My lord, when Chuan Chuan created his rendition, I took the chance to analyze his painting. There were some unexpected findings. Oh, like what? Okay. 
The style and age of the painting reveals the rather prominent background of the artist. During the turbulent era, a notable scholar-warrior protested the growing inequality by robbing vast amounts of property from the nobles of the Nine Kingdoms. He disappeared, and it is said that he lived in seclusion on Kunlun Island in his later years. Continue. I believe our artist may have hidden secret clues in this very painting. Mm -hmm. You mean it's like a treasure map? I like treasure maps. Exactly. Or to be precise, a treasure poem. What does a poem say? That sounds fun! If you look carefully, there's text written in the background. This is medieval Solarian text. What does it say? Allow me to translate it. Running translation system. Translation complete. My lord, the data has been uploaded to your database. Are you going on a treasure hunt, Yi? Can you bring me with you? Uh, I wouldn't get too excited. What if it's a trap? Well, ends that conversation. Poem hidden in the immortal's portrait. Ooh! Establish a deep relationship with Xuan Xuan. I have done this now, according to the achievement I just popped. The wealth of nine kingdoms hid deep in Kunlun, tucked in a grotto upon the eastern shore. The Fasan Cave painting points up to the skies. Keep flying, and you'll find treasure galore. This is the poem extracted from the Immortal's Portrait. It may have clues to where treasure is hidden. The Fasan Cave painting points up to the sky, huh? Wait a minute. I think I found this already. You guys remember on a previous run? <laughs> I think I was going through like one of these and then I just jumped up and found like a whole bunch of stuff. And I think I've already found that. <laughs> Oops. Whoop, I, 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 uh, a little too smart for my own get there. Bummer. All right, uh, let's see here. We got cash, right? 30, 32, 36 is pretty good cash. Um, what do we have to recycle? Just one standard component. That's not a lot. Now, let's see. Do I want to buy another poison? Or I have to, I do have to give a poison to uh, Dumpy over here. And it is a... What was it? A Plantago Frog. This nearly extinct poison this frog is said to be extremely delicious. However, its poison, when ingested, can infect your central nervous system and induce meningitis. Alright. <clears throat> Shannon, would you like this poisonous frog, sir? Hi, Return of MCH. You got a sword and a little Karibo, huh? He was doing Super Robot Wars. Super Robot Wars 30? There's been that many Super Robot Wars? Oh, it's too much. Anyway, Shannon. How is it? This toad is extremely rare, rumored to be delicious, but there have no been there have been no records of what it actually tastes like. Oh. Oh. Uh. What? So how does it taste? How how is this even possible? I wish you'd all... It's crispy on the outside and soft on the inside. You can't call this a toad. It's a bona fide high end meat. Huh? What? Really? It's the most delicious thing I've eaten here. No, it must be might be the best damn meat I've ever had. I Shannon, what's wrong? Shannon, hey! <coughs> what happened? Why are you yelling my name? Who are you? Where am I? Okay, no wonder they're watching their records. Bum, 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 bum. It caused you memory loss. <laughs> well, we have enough for another drink. I have a question. We were kidnapped by you monsters. Where did we originally come from? Pale blue planet. Huh? Your hometown is blue? It was. At least when we discovered it. Your home is just like Peng Lai. Oceans and life as far as the eye can see. But due to the presence of New Kun Lun, it's probably just a land of ice and snow now. Your sorcery can change entire worlds? Unbelievable. It's all my fault. Oh, it was the 30th anniversary Super Robot Wars game. It's actually the 64th game in the series. Out of control. I 
All right. Uh, I think I'm sure Chio has some more poisons for me, but let's see. You've got the wall climb and Geo. I didn't get that. Oh, do I? Oh, man, do I want to save for the computing unit though? I might want to do that instead. Let's save for the computing unit. Unless I really want to get some weapons from uh, Quafu over here. Let's see. Well, I don't think. Yeah, we can't get anything else because we don't have enough dark steel or herb catalysts, or enough for another Asher Sand magazine. All right, so let's sit on it and uh, see if we can come back. If we can get five thousand. And now the real reason we came back, which was to uh, teleport to that node over in. Yeah, here in the Grotto Scriptures. That's the ticket. Okay, can't go this way. I'm going down. Leads to here. And as I suspected, the panels have turned themselves horizontal while I was gone because they hate me. They hate us because they hate us. And now I have to fight all these dudes again. Fortunately, that dude's a punk. Alright, now we gotta find some passages or something here, I guess. Whoa! I forgot already about you. Come on, chump. Okay, you. Dang it! Well, I can put one on you at any time, really. Ouch! Beat up by a punk! That's rough, man. Well, I guess I'll go back over there and get it again. Once again, the doors are reset. Of course they have. I mean, the floors. That's not what I wanted to do. I wanted to go back. Yep. You pulled out all the stops and I just kind of fell asleep. Come on, back over. No! I don't want to fight you yet! Okay. Don't start it. Okay, that one's dead. Good. Ah, now die on that thing! Yeah, you dummy! <laughs> Hi. Oh, the bomb really got me. That bomb caused a lot of damage. Cool. Good to know. And he drops the bomb on death. Alright. So if I go back this way, that'll lead to down here, which doesn't solve anything for me, but I'll take out this guy.
Okay. So I gotta move. Ow. Jerk. Take that. Okay. So this leads me back over here. And here I thought that's something I could reflect back at him, but I guess not. So I can go up here, but it doesn't change anything, because I'm still just on this side of the, uh... of the wall here, which brings me back down here. No real progress, because I had access to all that already. Where I need to get to is on the left side. Isn't it like some weird thing where, like, the reset happened over here? Is it? We'll find out. Oh, you know what? I seem to recall... Ugh. Yeah, there was a platform there, but... I don't think it, it doesn't lead anywhere, because it leads just a sand thingy. From the wrong side, anyway. Okay. Ah! Caught underneath it. Awkward. Ow, ow, ow. Step back. Should probably just leave that guy. <laughs> that dude shoots red. <sighs> hmm, hmm, hmm. This is a puzzler. So. What if I went to the right and then back around to the left? Maybe as long as I don't leave the entire biome, I can make it back around. We'll find out. The last time I went here, it was just to get to the... It was just to get to the root node to get back. What if I don't do that? What if I go straight left? What if? Do I want a hint? Hang on. Not quite there yet. Give me a moment to figure out whether I want a hint. And then I continue left this way. And then I don't think it's going to be good, but we'll give it a shot. And then I'll get a hint. <laughs> Through here, back through here. Oh yeah, it doesn't work at all because we're still back on this side. Yeah, that wouldn't work anyways. Right, no, wouldn't work anyways. And the reset. Okay, what's the hint? Wait, wait, wait. Never mind. I have a thought. I think I have a thought. Maybe. <laughs> uh, here, which I get to from, ah, uh, crumbs. How do I get here? <laughs> but I'm staring at it in the middle of the screen. That's the one I want to get to. I'm trying to remember which one connects to that, though. It's the one up here, in the upper left, right? Isn't it? Am I crazy? You know what? I can, there's an easy way to find out where this connects to. There's a very easy way. It's called drop your butt down there. I want to get over there to the right. But let me uh, jump around just to see, make sure I know how to get where it connects. And make sure I can get there.
So this is where I want to be. And I connect via this. Okay, I can do this. In fact, I didn't even do that. I could just climb up from there. That's probably one of the best way to climb up from there, actually. Okay, think I got it, think I got it, think I got it. Oh, God. Thank you for the uh, uh, offering anyways, Tana MR. That was very kind of you, but I think I might have it. Probably should just stay on the ground. There we go. I don't think I have to do this, but... It wasn't even necessary. Just keep walking. Okay. Probably some more will show up, because... This game's evil like that, apparently. Or not. Ah! Oh no! There's two of them! Oh, there's two of them! Interrupted. Talos Menace interrupt us. Come on then. Oh, fine. Got it. Okay. What's next? Oh, the hacking. Hacking goo! Drops this, probably. Crunch. Alright, where's this door go? Hey, I know this door. It's probably kind of tough to access, but I did it. Huh, so I hit... I did hit my two experience point markers, so that's good. Okay, now we're here. We came from there, that broke. Don't think I can get back up that way for right now, but... Looks like the rock broke completely. Interesting. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Door is open. Now, there's the door from before. Uh, we've been that way already. It didn't. It wasn't fun the first time. Ah, jerk! No, stop! I got one boot. Oh, that was awful. <laughs> Uh, okay, now where am I? All right, I can just drop straight down from here. Thankfully, I think I can just do that without dying, of course. Thankfully, because I died to the because <laughs> oh, because I died to the roots that my uh, my flower is just on the ground. Windy. Uh huh. Oh shit! Uh, not the not the actual white wave to dodge through. You gotta dodge through the red wave. I don't. I think I'm gonna lose those. But that's okay. There's just a hole over there. Seems to be just a hole over there. But there is a door we can't open. Cool. Yes, average orb experience. Oh, interesting. When you put a talisman on the one guy, his doppelganger also freezes. Noted. Taking that into account. 
Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Elevator. Open the door. Neat. Uh, e Ooh, yeah, we're pretty good on that. But let's spend our skills. Skill point. Because we have... Yes, we'll take full control. Yeah. Isn't that the jade that applies to your talisman to two targets? So no, it's this jade, the one I got earlier, the stasis one, the one that attacked, that it temporarily mobilizes the enemy. That is good, but then again, maybe it is the... But why would it treat the specter as a second target? Well, never mind. I could be a fool. So do we want to try at least full control, see how that works? Just, just, just to know we really hate it, <laughs> off the bat. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Keep one left. Up the elevator. Door is... Oh! I thought that was more than I, I bargained for, so that's cool. Dude, you're sitting weird. But moving on. This is probably the second of the, uh... The trials. Hi, G. Oh no, it's a it's a Shanghai robot. Well, bet my friend. Oh no, it is G. Okay, it looked like a Shanghai robot for a second there. My apologies. I'm just finishing up this last paragraph. Is it so important? Oh, is it so important that you have to write it down right now? <laughs> <laughs> Every story needs an ending. Right. All done now. Welcome to my humble little library, my friend. It might look dreary, but many intriguing events from the past are etched into these pillars. So Sol G is still a chron chronicler. What other secrets are you hiding? <laughs> Please, don't misunderstand. I only use these crystals for personal note-keeping. They help me recall memories worth remembering. It began as a casual hobby, but look what it has become. Got the chatter and give it to me straight. Why are you even secretly approaching me? I want to know more about you, that is all. Like a lighthouse standing tall in the night sky, great figures like yourself will always shine with a certain splendor. A splendor not dimmed by mortality. Uh huh. <laughs> Due perhaps to some divine prank, age means nothing to me. Impossible. How long have you lived? <laughs> How could this be possible, right? I don't understand it either, even after several lifetimes. Why was I given this miracle? I have neither grand ambitions nor excessive desires. I have never coveted power, nor did I seek to bring about peace. Even on the brink of apocalypse, I did not feel the need to save anyone. Through every era, those that I have cared about always leave me behind. You're ageless and immortal. That's an ability that many can only dream of. That's true if you're a spectator, but for me it feels more like a curse. Alas, I also lack the courage to end this curse myself. Does my mentor, does Aegong know about this too? I don't get it. Why'd you chose to join the council? The Tianhua virus doesn't seem to have an effect on you at all. Mm. Staying in Pang Lai meant eternal loneliness, and I have endured enough loneliness. Besides, I made a promise, however meaningless, to protect this grotto for a friend. Just hand over your soul seal and I guarantee the grotto will not be harmed in any way. Oh. oh, are you going easy on me? You never participated much in the council and I'm not keen on exterminating the ancient Kunlun tribe. I just need your permission. I don't want to fight. But I have never disobeyed destiny. Oh. Have you forgotten already? I have always held great confidence in the answers my divination provides. What? What did you see in the hexagrams? I'm so sorry, but you will die by my hand today, Yi. Standing before you is the deputy captain of the Fangxi Guild Elite Guard, Sojourner Ji. May the clouds part and allow true light to illuminate our decisive battle. Indulge me with a sparring session, friend. Let's do it. 
Sorry, what? So I get to choose the attacks, huh? Ooh, ah. Ow. Ah. Don't do this! Rude! How rude. Oh, boo. Okay, that's cool. That's cool. We can fight, we can keep fighting. There, I died. Are we done now? <laughs> Uh, this one. Let's try the one with the knives. <laughs> Which seems to be kind of your thing anyway. Okay. Oh, you picked the black bulb. Can I not talisman him? Interesting. Did that not cause him damage? Uh, or did... was he out of it at that point? Oh, they're just coming back now, huh? Ah, crumbs. Oh, it's because I have full control turned on, I just realized. So... Hmm... How about, instead of full control, I just do normal for now. <laughs> normal chi blast. We still have our arrows, don't forget. Probably best to use the Thunder Buster. Yeah, I'll try that one again. Oh, you can blow it up. Well, how about I do that then? There we go. Regular old talisman slaps. Probably didn't want the black hole, though. Nope. Can't hit it. Try to smoke here, bro. That's what I should do. I should wave dash on him. This one seems to work well, so I'll stick with it. Uh, let's see. I don't know about this one yet. Oh, this one drops pipe? Oh, neat. 
Yeah, it interrupts health. Cool, I'll take that. Dang it. That's what I want, because that's when you stall. Oh, he's just doing this now. Yeah, I didn't think that was a, the whole thing. It's time to end this! Yep, round two, here we go. Oh. Woo! Ah, that's the wrong way. You can probably, I could probably unbound that one. It's just a melee slam at the end of the day. Definitely gonna use that. Okay, now we toke. Toke again. This one. Whatever it is, I don't know about it. <laughs> I didn't know I was on the homing. I did not know I was on the homing. Oh, right, that. Dang it, that's quick, though. Ah. Oh. I brought out a dash. I used my dash in the air and then I ran out and tried to hit it again. Silly me. You can get it out quick, but not that quick. I suppose I should just be expecting it. 
and then just stay on the ground because you can't unbound counter while in the air. Probably got a talisman in there, but that's okay. For some reason, I seem to be waiting for the, uh... Dang. For some reason, I seem to be waiting for the spear thing, which is a really good opportunity to counter him, but... Oh well. Next run. Speaking of which, I beat Dark Souls, uh... Yesterday? Yeah, beat Dark Souls yesterday. All the way through in the DLC as well. Only didn't fight a couple of bosses, uh, Priscilla and Gwendolyn. I just, I didn't want to. <laughs> like, I didn't feel the need to bug Priscilla, and Gwendolyn, it just wasn't worth it. for that, but go for it, I did. I'm gonna let you drop it before I slap it. <laughs> Although it might get sucked into the black hole. Ugh! Or me! Maybe I get sucked into the black hole. Ugh. So that was, I tried it. I tried the unbounded counter, but I was too late. It's, you have to respond quick, because you have to pretty much immediately parry an arrow, or a knife, and then, uh, then hit the, the counter. But I can do it. I'm gonna do it. It's gonna get done. Gotta be a cool guy.
really not a lot of healing, though. But I'll take it over other stuff. Dang it. I'll take it over the black hole, certainly. Round two. Here we go. Now remember, black hole, then after black hole, it's the slam. Yeah, I gotta prep for the slam. Every time I'll get hit by that. Every time. Oh, well, I can't prepare for the slam if I'm dead. I suppose that's true. It's one knife and then the slam. I'm so glad I picked up the quick stand. It's probably helping me without even me realizing it's helping me. Oh well. Whoops. That's that one. Oh well. Just put it up here. Whoops! Ate that one hard. Oh well. Just keep trying, keep trying. And stop doing stupid stuff. I could explore elsewhere. I realize I have opened up other paths. But I feel like... I gotta get this guy. I gotta get him good. Oh, it's doing really good, and then I get hit by that.
Oh! Dodged way too early, quite frankly. Way too early. Thank you for convenient root nodes right outside the bus. Kirby Perry is all day today. Why don't you? Two. Here we go. Try this again. <clears throat> there. Put. 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 It works. Didn't do much, but it worked. Here it comes again, I'm not ready this time, so fuck it. Oh. Smoke! Just smoke quick. <laughs>
Now what? Oh, okay. <laughs> you know, I was failing it. I was freaking failing it. Oh my god. Just a moment. Oh, just a slight rest. There we go. Uh, let's see. Oh, right, it did work. Okay, cool. I guess I think it did. No. How did I screw that up? <sighs> Unless there's a... Okay. Okay, cool. One of your favorites, huh? <laughs> Good, I'm glad. Absolutely not. I pushed the wrong button. I meant to switch to my Thunderbuster. See, I'm playing on an Xbox 360 controller, so I'm my my meaty fingers are hitting the uh, left and the up when I hit the pipe. So uh, arrows tend to be a random thing. <laughs> if I hit him with a Thunderbuster, I probably would have finished him then. But Again. Nope. Good waste of that. Oh, this bad run. This run's going bad already. Nice, huh? I didn't mean to hit that, but this is the uh, one where he just, yeah, does this. I kind of got that one solved. Well, I'll wait for it. <laughs> He didn't put set it down. Oh well. It was mostly full anyway. Alright, my friend. Time to show you all that I've learned from the deaths to you. <laughs> Whoops. And I failed with the unbranded counter. I just held it way too long.
Boo. Spend it. Spend the nickel. Whoops! It's my favorite thing, the black hole. But then let's always screw up a carrier three on this, uh... Well, at least he didn't hit me this time. Okay, knife. Again? Okay, cool. If you like it. And again we go. Ow. <sighs> Dang it. Sure, why not? Oh, this is a normal one! Whoops! We're doing it again, huh? Okay, cool. Well, I didn't see which one it was, so we're just going randoms here. Okay, this is the real one. Yes! Whew! I 
How are you feeling? Oh. Uh, just a moment. Oh, man. Just a quick... Hit on that. <coughs> How nostalgic. Your moves feel exactly like his. It appears that your hexagrams have failed you. If I told you the result, would you still have tried your utmost? At least one of us got to enjoy the thrill of the unknown. You lied to me. <laughs> A good story needs an interesting twist, does it not? <coughs> Is this the end? I have witnessed the springs of Tian Shan burst forth and dry out. I have seen the long shadows cast by mountains of corpses as night fell at Fang Shan. I was there when the Donghuan bell rang for the first time. I walked through countless cities, drowned in time. All of it has now attained wholeness within the Tao. Like a shooting star that sears its mark between heaven and earth. Cool, dude. Let me have your flower at least. <gasps> Does he not have a flower? He doesn't have a flower. What does it mean, folks? Oh. G's hair. A strand of hair taken from G, its specific purpose, is unclear. G's corpse never showed any signs of decay. The usual Tianhua flowers are also absent. Well, but he's kind of going. Give me your dumb thing. Guardian of life, master of time, we worship you. Can't imagine G was getting that was getting kind of old for G at some point. I, Jie Tong, born as a warrior, shall perish as a hero. Farewell, my friend. The struggles of life and death no longer concern me. We have finally transcended our destiny with our own hands. We are no longer mortal. Flower, bugs, things, and G just kind of hooked up to it all. So G is the actual immortal that everyone else's somewhat immortality was derived from. All of it has now attained wholeness within the Tao. Insight? Which one is he? A soul seal is the greatest symbol of power in the council and a key to unlock the council code. It is a soul's proof of authority. G's soul seal, containing the character Gui, signifies insight. G often observed the world as a bystander, following the rise and ultimate demise of countless great individuals over the centuries. These experiences made him deeply envious of those who ended their lives spectacularly and sparked a yearning in him for his own magnificent curtain call. Oh, hi! Booting. Loading. Initializing. Hello. Thank you for using the Shanghai 1000 testing model. So this one's unoriginal. He's not the current 9000 model. I am the latest assistive robot capable of deep learning through conversation. Feel free to browse the database or engage me in an Q&A. Shanghai 1000. Is this a prototype? Incorrect. That command does not exist in the database. It doesn't seem too bright. Incorrect. That command does not exist in the database. 
Give me a status report on this region. Uh, no. Incorrect. That command does not exist in the database. What were you made to do? Shanghai is a public welfare experiment funded by the Fengxi Guild. I can look up information, play audio files, calculate mathematical equations, and make noodles. The purpose of the Shanghai 1000 shifted constantly through its 50-year development period. It currently has no clear purpose. Please contact the developers if you would like to purchase one. You were there when the Fengxi Guild was still active. Okay. Keyword confirmed. Fengxi Guild. Retrieving. The Fengxi Guild is an international scientific organization founded by the thinker Lear. Its purpose is, was to put an end to all wars. Lear believed that peace could be found using science, so he gathered those with lofty ideals, and together they built a research complex on the island of Kunlun. Today, the guild is home to the most advanced technology on Panglai, as demonstrated in Kunlun's Sustainable Development Zone. The guild's technology spread to every corner of the world and helped to end the century-long food and energy crisis. However, Lear has also become has also been launching non-compliance movements due to each nation's lack of interest in his anti-war initiatives. This move has paralyzed operations in all major governments and institutions. Why are you in G's warehouse? Okay. Keyword confirmed. G. Loading G's latest development log. First month of year 3773, turbulent era. We installed the third iteration of the head. I wanted to put a real fish inside, but the maintenance would have been too costly. It ended up being a display instead. I wanted to fill it with water. Oh, shit. <laughs> Lear told me that I didn't need to use its appearance to symbolize Peng Lai. He kept asking me to cut features from the Shanghai 1000 to make it more practical, but I don't want it to be mass-produced. Spectators innately understand that fireworks from afar always look prettier than those in your midst. I wonder how many more years will I be able to converse with him. Goodbye. Goodbye. Thank you for your patronage. Feel free to leave a review and any comments about your experience. Also, follow us on TikTok. Can I have your chip? Warning. Removing the map data chip will cause irreversible damage. To transfer image assets, it is recommended that you provide 400 physical units to obtain a copy. Confirmed and connected with the payment. Replicating map data. Grotto Scriptures. Mysterious Grotto Scriptures was once the Feng Shi Guild's headquarters. G had been maintaining and protecting these caves for centuries after Lair's passing. Wow. Okay, sorry, I had to let that one rock. Because there were no subtitles for that one, so we just had to kind of listen to that. But yeah. 
it, it's unknown what that all was. That could have been something, G, the, some memories that G kept for himself, or uh, it could be like, you know, sly dev messages, for all we know. All right, where are we? Where are we going? Where have we been? What's down there? Hmm. Okay, we still, I still want to get there. What's a good way to get there from here? Because what I want is to get to this side, the left side of the place, while this, um, while the things are vertical, so... With all that in mind, let's continue our way down and reconnect here. And this connects me to down here, which is difficult. But I can use it to get back up. Okay. It is doable. So. Oh, that's right. I forgot about you guys. Excuse me. I forgot. So, where, where's this? This was up here. Probably I wanted to get back up to the... Uh... I don't know if I could do that from here, actually. Well, no, I can't. I can go outside. And then climb up that way. Excuse me. Excuse me. Excuse me. Peace be with you, gentlemen. Yeah. Woo. Okay, now we hit the root node. Let's head back to the pavilion, just for now. Oh, hey. What's up, Shonhuan? Hmm, there's no more space on the floor. How about the shelf? Not enough room for all your stuff? Uh, no, I, I can make more room. <laughs> I've only just realized how many interesting things you've taught me. Look at all the stuff you brought me, too. And I thought you were just trying to brush me off at first. I didn't expect you to you'd just be so interested in Solarian affairs. It's really fun. I didn't realize there was so much out there in your world to learn. But what I don't get is if Pungla was so interesting, why'd you guys leave? We didn't want to leave. Us Salarians got sick. We couldn't stand Pung Lai anymore. Did they get better after coming here? They didn't. But just like with your book, if you don't read the last page, you won't you need to fear the, the bad ending. What? I never read the ending of a story. I don't really want an ending. I wouldn't worry. I think there's still a long way to go before you read Shore Ending. Chuan Chuan. Under Yi's influence, Chuan Chuan has gained a deep understanding of the knowledge and culture of the Solarians. He has also been applying this knowledge in new ways. What he doesn't know is that this will have a profound impact for all future ape men. They're gonna go ape. Anyone else have anything to say? Abacus, you got new stuff? Uh, yes, actually. Abacus Rui. My lord, don't you think there are quite a few similarities between Xuan Xuan and Hung? The result of their personality analyses are also quite similar. If your humble servant could express an opinion, having Xuan Xuan wake you up was the most incredible stroke of luck I've ever witnessed. That's all you got, huh? And I got nothing in response. That boy, Xuan Xuan, is using the stones to tell fortunes. Must have learned it from the villagers. Uh, what a disgrace. My village must seem like a complete joke to you people. Oh, really? We also do divination. Abacus was probably the one who ta taught him that. No, no. What? How can that be? You can fly and create contraptions, but you still believe in these formless ideas? Faith is used to control the ignorant. You're not supposed to be that gullible. Mm. I used to ponder the same conundrum. But maybe there's a reason why faith can't be replaced. Maybe. 
Yo, Chi, yo. Let's go, man. To be frank, I know one or two things about face reading. Would you be interested in allowing me a look? <sighs> Back from the grotto, and the first thing I see is another fortune teller. Fine, let's hear it. You have a wide forehead, along with a thin, narrow nose, a calamitous sign. <laughs> Hoarding wealth will harm you a hundredfold, whereas spending it will bring you good fortune. I have here a collection of one-of-a-kind treasures, never to seen, be seen again once sold. Would you like to take a look? You know, face reading needs a lot of work, but I think you get the gist of it. Wah, wah. He does get the gist of it. It's about fleecing money. 42.18, huh? Man, I hope I won't have to go farming <laughs> for this stuff. Oh, well. I want to get that other computing chip, though, if I can help it. We're almost there. Got G's soul seal? So did you ever figure out what he was? It was always a mystery to me how someone so little could make, could sound like a living antique. So you've actually met G. Uh, of course I have. He read my fortune and said I would spend the rest of my life away from my hometown. What nonsense. He even invited me to the Grotto of Scriptures, saying he wanted to show me a secret no one's ever seen before. Was that his idea of a joke? Everyone knows the Grotto's biggest secret is the Grave of Lear, which no one can seem to find. Who would ever want to step foot in those catacombs? He must be crawling with countless vengeful bungshi souls. Nope, just the robots. Just your usual robot dudes. And map data for you, sir. If you're all the same model, why do you all talk so differently? You, Solarians, all talk the same. Is that a fair comparison? Go ask people who made us. If I could, I wouldn't be asking you. Alright. Cleared. Oh, Jude, I hope your dad's alright. Whoa! I am shy on treasures here. Holy cow, there's a lot of stuff to be found here. Most intriguing. Yep, there's another lore here and another treasure here. Uh huh. And down here is clean. This is clean. And we just went a little bit here, Imperian District, which I think is our next uh, destination anyway. But most of this has all been cleaned out, as I recall. Alright. No one ever feel a little poor after, uh... Oh, right, he's got to get stuff for me after a G. Do you believe in any gods, ye? The village elders always told us to believe in the gods. They said doing so would make us healthy, give us good loot, looks, and give us boneless meat to eat. I mean, do you believe in the gods? Kind of. It'd be nice if the gods turn out to be true. But not everyone has... Every question has an answer, right? I suppose. It's not like I'll ever know if that oracle's divination was ever accurate now. Alright. Back to the grotto. Clean that place out. Last note should be fine. Okay. We got a lot of stuff to find here. So let's get cooking by going over here and dropping down and going right. So we're going to hit this and then we're going to try to go as far down as we can. So that should put us... We should be able to go right there, down and left, and that should reach the path we want to take here. Eh, what if I'm not interested? Or what if I want to lure you away? Haha! <laughs> oh, god. The point was not to have you. Shit! Oh boy, it's getting good. Okay, 20 down. Okay. 
Cool. So, now I should be able to go down left. Yep. I guess I just took out the shield. And that leads me... This way. Back up here. And now... All things being equal, I should be able to go back around and get to the, uh... Oh boy. Oof. Okay. Down to the right again. Yeah, there we go. Treasure chest. Oh, hey, another computing unit. Each additional... Yeah, we've seen this before, so... <laughs> Dead. And there's this, which I passed by originally and didn't go in, so now I can go in this one, I guess. This is probably one of the uh, dudes. Yep, yeah, here we go again. Oh, because it's just the wall. Or the floor, rather. Fine. We're doing this again. It's too late. Let it go too early this time. Screw it up. Oh, I charged too early. And then I ran out. Wait for the white circle to appear. That was a good time. Why? Why? But why? Let's see if I can do it without dying. I got an hour of attempts. Well, I didn't need it, so thank you. <laughs> Secret Mural 3, about the three great sages of Taoism. Lu Yan, one of the three great sages, astounded all nine kingdoms by leading a team of a hundred to take control over the Haotian Sphere. The battle resulted in tens of thousands of casualties for the GA and the destruction of the satellite. In addition to their technology, the Fangxi Guild is also known for its warriors, having inherited Lair's unique fighting style and wielding high-tech weapons and gear. Fangxi soldiers were famous for their power and integrity. Near the end of the turbulent era, when it was clear that the GA kingdom would not give up arms, 
arms, Lair asked Luyan to establish this, the Martial Division. Lair and Luyan would lead this division to fight, undefeated, in over 100 battles and skirmishes. The Martial Division. So, the other... And this just opens, and Luyan pops out. I am the chief of the Feng Shi Guild's Martial Division, Sojourner Luyan. So, get out. You can go now. Well, what's the hint? I mean, uh, if you're talking about the climb, that's one thing. I think I figured that part out. But if you, the other hint is, how, what's the pattern? Well, I just got to figure it out and see it. So, let's see. The last door is... Could be down there, maybe? Hmm. Okay, that was G's door. So, okay. Okay, okay, okay. First things first, we gotta get to the, um, we gotta get back to the root node. Because I'm a little peckish. Ugh. Right, now, let's go to that drop down over there. That might lead me to something. So, drop down this way and this way. So, just running away is the right call, honestly. <laughs> Aha! But not the door I wanted. The Divine Hand Jade. After a successful unbounded counter to perform continuous unbounded counters, gain a powerful defensive ability along with higher risks in execution. Holy crap. I don't understand what kind of situation I'd use that for. They never really set it up that I need more than one. This puts me right here. Of course it does. No, you can't swing your knife. Sorry, bro. Stop with the madness. All right. <laughs> Couldn't find that stuff. Gotta open up the thing. Where could the other thing be? Not entirely sure. Hmm. Oh, there's a mini boss around here somewhere. Hmm. Where could he be? Is there an up here, or is it just the? Yeah, it's just the over. Wait, hang on. Never mind. Eh? <laughs> it don't work. It's fine. It's fine. I don't mind. I don't mind. But, there was always this. We never went in here, did we? Let's go, let's go. This is the Empyrean District, as before. We do have to go here eventually, but... We now know three ways into the Empyrean District, including the main way I think we're supposed to go, which is the, uh, the Daybreak Tower down below. All right. Uh, hey, hoo, oh, hey, hey, hoo, oh, oh, oh. Hmm. Is that something to do with over here? Right, getting over there. Wasn't necessary. I need a door. Oops. Getting some of them. Crap, there's a whole bunch that uh, Chi Yo has, and the machine. I, I might be out. Ooh. I'm trying to count up the remaining that both Chi Yo and the uh, creator machine have. I only have one point. And I think that might be it for Jade's. I just gotta be able to buy them. Okay. We did that. We did that. We got up there. So much stuff to find. I'm sure a lot of it's in that uh, behind that big door, but first we gotta find the little door.
Ow. Jerk. Take that. And that. Okay. Let's see. Down was a fall. And over here there was nothing, I recall. Yep, just a passage. And up above... Nothing right now, anyway. No point. Well, I could go over here. This would just take me up above. Just hop me back up. I just want to get rid of that guy, because he fires red arrows. That is a big statue of Lear in the back, I just realized. <laughs> kind of a thing you don't really see until you see it. That's two down, one to go. I mean, assuming. Yeah, the whole point is just it. All right, so if I go up this way, it'll lead me over to that passage. I don't think there's another... Uh... That was a bad jump. That was a big bad jump. That was a better jump. And this doesn't leave anything but the transport. Okie day. <laughs> I don't know why I thought that would work. Ouch. That works. Here. Eat that, jerk. And thanks for the sand. Big door is Lear's grave. How much hype? Yeah. Most likely. How much they're hyping it up. This puts me here. Which is down here. And... Once again, I'm not in the mood for this area. This is just a rough fight. Right, him too. Well, I hit my 5,000 anyway. No, it's a self, try not to die. This is just too comp compact to fight in. You know, I'm curious. Is it possible that the third one could be on the far s Yeah, it could easily, because so was another one. Alright, maybe we should just check back in the east. See if there's anything cool going on over there. And I'll take the train there. Because think about it, that was the third one. Oh, hi, Chuan Chuan. What do you guys- Oh, he's making pottery! Right, that clay I got him. I found some funny red clay! This is a pottery wheel. Uncle Chubby made it for me. Mm. Oh, that red, that's red grief on clay. That's not so rare, it might as well be priceless. It'd be such a waste of processing without the proper tools. I thought he was just going to need something small. Mm. Forget about small, he should be able to make those del delicate Taoist statues with ease now. You guys are certainly taking it easy. I thought of a theme. For, I thought of a new theme for my next piece. What is it? <laughs> it's a secret. Oh, well now you've got me a little curious. Just look forward to the final product. Uh. No matter what shape your next masterpiece takes, just be sure to be gentle with that wheel. Retribution awaits those who mistreat machines. Harsh retribution. 
All right, Chiyo, give me another uh, computing unit on top of the one I have. <laughs> I did just pick up one, didn't I? And that's the last one of those. So one, two, three, four, five jades here, and I think another one in the... Uh... Oops, another one in the creator. Yep, and that's all the remaining jades in the game. Another pipe vial I can buy. Hopefully the last one. <laughs> Man, you need a lot of money to get everything in this game. I might have to go grinding. You need a lot of money. Whee. I don't really have to go grinding, probably, but... I'm sure I can manage... the rest of the game, but... Uh, hmm. Well, this one has more lore, which suggests that there's also uh, a statue here. Off tree grinding, woo! <laughs> yeah. So, there was that one door, but there's something else up there to the, the top, so let's check it out, I guess. You know what, I probably should just knock out that shield generator first. Seems like the smart thing to do. That almost got him. <laughs> almost gave him the old Looney Tunes act. Instead, I'll just shank him in the back. Just like John Wayne would have done. Yeah, I've already proven I can't get back here. I don't know, maybe it's a... Uh, oh, teleport back around. Maybe it's another cave that I'm missing. A cave passage. Because that's how this place usually operates. So there's that. But what's below me here? That is not a cave passage. Well, hang on. Another idea. Now, that won't work there, will it? I'm trying to use that rock that we got. That's gonna break there if we... I think. I mean, I guess it's worth a try. I figured as much. And when I let it down here, it rolled down into the walls here and gave me access to this door. Before smashing it. I don't think there was a chest there or something, but we were done with that. So. Alright, let's go back and explore just one little bit more, and then we might just say heck with it for right now. Hmm, nothing down there, nothing down there. Okay. Curious. Curious about the, ca the capacity of my drone to fly around. Oh yeah, there is this. Okay, there's a rope here. Let's go underneath and see what's that at the end of here. So, there is, it is a cave passage somewhere that leads there. Hmm. Because it's not there, so let's see if we can find it. What the hell? Why not? Maybe it's something I just literally walked past last time I was here. Does sound like me. OK, 
Okay, there it is. Oh, that's it. That's the last door right there. So it's there. Cool. But now I gotta get there. Less cool. Then you money, I'd just walk right past it. It really sounds like something I do. Okay, and then we go here. Whoop. Imperfect parries. Then we open that. I don't think that's a, uh... Nope, not. this way. Hmm. Hi. What if I just say no? What if I just say I'm leaving you alone? I appreciate the small rocks that follow the heraldy approach of the the rock, the big rock, because that's the only way I'm gonna know. That was a bad jump. You were almost dead though, weren't you? Well, now you're deader. Indeed, one little teleporty doorways. Thanks. I figured as much, but it's nice to have confirmation. There and it's not there. Hmm. I'm open to thoughts. Is it on my map and I just keep walking by it, or There it is, right there. Is it somewhere? Oh, see, okay, somewhere near the root node, huh? Did I go down? I thought I went down here before. Did I literally never just walk in here? That was it. Thank you. Thank you for the hint. Very kind. That explains all the cool. Uh, <laughs> chest in the area, so that's that last one. Let's pop that. Well, this one doesn't say there's a mini-boss fight, so what could this all be? Ow. What if I'm not in the mood? What if I'm not in the mood? What? I got trolled. I got trolled super hard.
That is stuck. Oh, it, dro it drops the thing. Okay, okay, cool. Oh, neat. It's the button also. Good gravy gumption. Uh-huh. Okay. Oh, that's how I'm supposed to get down there in the first place, right? Shit, am I screwed? Ugh. Ugh. Barely not screwed. So here's how we do it. We drop the rock, and then we drop another rock. Just keep dropping rocks. Alright. Sound like it made it. It made it. Cool. Whew. Okay, here we go. You're gonna love this. <laughs> oh shit. None of them died. One's dead. Two's dead. Any more? Come on, I'm ready now. Damn it! I'm not ready. Jerks! Ah, oh, man, I gotta go through much of that again. All right, uh, down. Yeah, you chill, bro. Not a boss, not a mini boss, but it is. Dude's gotta be like this. <sighs> I was on the ground. That's the problem. Toke. Very toke. Get him. Get him, Thunderbuster! Okay. That went harder than I wanted it to. So now I have to do this dumb thing again. You know what? Before I go all the way in to do something that's probably going to be beat my butt, I'm going to unblock this. There. Beat my little furry behind over here. Alright! Whoops. Uh, 
Do I have to turn around to face the... Uh... I've been doing it on habit, but... Still probably good to do it. A couple tries that time. Nice. Of course, that was the easy one. That was number one, so I think it's completely out of order, but that's okay. <clears throat> Information about the three great sages of Taoism. Yin Jifu, first of the three great sages, battled alongside Lear, led the Fangxi de Kunlung, and established a research complex. He led hundreds of researchers and devoted his life to Fangxi technology. Lear's three great laws sent shockwaves throughout the entire scientific community. Top scholars from all over Peng Lai, enamored by his abilities and ideals, clamored to him, forming an international scientific alliance and the predecessor to the Feng Shi Guild. Among the scholars in the alliance, none were as brilliant or had the ear of Lier as much as the Chan Kingdom's top scientist, Yin Jifu. After the Feng Shi Guild was formed, he became Lier's right-hand man. I am the director of the Feng Shi Guild's Kunlun Research Complex, Sojourner Yin Jifu. Now go to that thing and open it up. You did it, bro. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, since um, <laughs> Miniboss was on the map in the other area, I got the weird feeling we're going to be facing a Miniboss in Lear's Grave, which would be on brand for this game, certainly. Uh, might be quickest to... Here and root node. Plus, there's that healing I'm undoubtedly going to need. Oh, jerks! That mom sent the bonfire. <laughs> Teleporting. It's what's for dinner. Oh. So, no one was going to tell me I was sitting on two empty computing nodes, huh? <laughs> or were you just waiting for me to figure it out? Ah, okay. Um, now, one of the ones I really liked... I wanted to... Was it this one? Uh, yeah, this one. It was one of the three Bs. It was this one. Yeah, this is the one I want. All right, so let's pull off this for a second, put this on, and let's see. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. And then find a onesie. I don't need that. <laughs> I just want a onesie. This next pair will complete any ongoing charging for charge trick and the immediate advance we use. Eh. Gin collection radius, eh. Toss of an explosion, eh. I suppose for right now we can sit on that. But yeah, I really wanted this one to inflict damage on enemies with precise parries. Ooh. Sorry about the bro. Um, let's see, let's see. What am I sitting on for gin right now? No, not much. Well, let's just say not enough. To the other place. Here. And yeah, this is clean, right? Yep, completely clean. Four chests in here and one mini boss. May just and all of them be in Lear's grave there. Okay. Uh, down, straight down? Nope, down right. Okay. Here we are. Oh, oops. oh, okay. Mini boss is right out here. 
Why don't? No, we're not surprised. Stop! Everybody stop! I'll just keep my distance. Hey! Wait for the bombs, wait for the bombs. Big, that was a big hit there. Big wombo. Okay. We know what we're dealing with. Those annoying enemies. Ooh, teleport. Create doppelgangers. It's good enough. <laughs> Immediately. Well, there goes my there goes that two thousand gin I had. Oh well. I got distracted by my flower still sitting there. I'm like, oh right, I should get that. And then, like, oops, can't get it now. Those, uh, those, uh, yeah, they sure are. Those bombs are a lot to deal with. Get some distance. Great, nice place. Problem with that one is if you get hit by one, you're gonna get hit by all three. This guy's rough. This guy is rough. There's an Azure Sand thingy there, so I should really should be using the arrows a lot more whenever I can. Just for some damage. The homing ones would hit him more, but it probably would give me less damage. But we'll see how we're feeling about that.
Oh man, hard one. This guy is something else. We're not even moving on to the next uh, biome, are we? Because we're going to be probably spending the rest of the evening t finishing this guy off. Got half an hour left, anyway. Take that pot. You've mocked me for the last time. Time is all messed up. And that's that ball game. Oof. Okay, let me think. Is there any other jades I could apply that could make this better? Probably don't need the gin reward. There's the immediate charge after a uh Precise parry that might help. Eh. That's pretty legit. Oh, I just wanted the pipe. Well, I'm thinking about Jades. Uh, yes, stop stalling him is good. May not need that. May not need that either. So, isn't there one that's like pipe goes a lot faster? Or is that the one I haven't bought yet? <laughs> that could be the one I haven't bought yet. Hmm. Let's see. That's about one. Yeah, I don't want to take the damage though. This might be handy, maybe. Like some terminal damage. I guess, I mean, apart from things that I should be, I would have bought otherwise. Hmm. I guess. <laughs> and I guess. Yeah, there's another jade that allows you to use your pipe a lot more quickly, but I haven't bought it yet, because I didn't think I'd need it. Typical of me. Now, I do have some stuff I could sell, now I realize this. So if it really gets nasty... The East Tabletop RPG. I have honestly never played East. 
even though the opportunities have always presented themselves, and the series continues, even after all these years. Good thought. If I need out. Oh man, can we cheese this sucker? Ah. Oh, probably not. But if we need a reprieve. He does regain health. Okay, I noticed that. Yep. Guess what? I don't care if it regenerates health. I'm token. So weird that that's the easiest track to respond to. Or at least it's getting me that way anyway. Dang it! Well, come on, over here. I gotta be close enough to you so you don't gain too much health back. be working better actually. Oh, I'm out. Never mind. So basically, whoops, one more. Yes, I believe you have posted much East music in the, in the server, but a lot of music has been posted. Unfortunately, I can't keep up with it all. I apologize for that. Alright. that. 
Ugh. Dang it! The triple slash. Whew. Almost got him. Almost got him. Almost got him. Not bad. Come on. This title is Spirit Keeper. <laughs> yeah? This is a big boy for big for a big uh, big job. I mean, this is, uh, this is harder than some of the bosses I've faced, this guy here. Dang it. That's down swipe. Can't do nothing to that. Ah. Look at me being silly. Hang on. Wow. Might just pack this one in. Oh, okay. I'd rather you not join the fight. Dang it. This. <laughs> oh, come on, I was heading for the, the rubber raptor. Uh... Yeah, that number is getting slightly higher because of the guys I'm killing on the way. Hey, it's a good way to farm, maybe. Who knows? Kill the one guy.
Okay. Hmm, should have taken the first shot there. Dangerous, dangerous. Tai Chi kick. Blech, blech. <sighs> this is kind of why I straight again. God damn it! Kind of why I straight against the idea of doing Souls likes or Souls games. This is a Souls like game, but you know, thought more Hollow Knight and less Souls. I mean, because Hollow Knight kind of has that too, but... That Slash, man. I cannot track it when it's on the ground. Smoke. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That's my spinning move in the midair. It's a Tai Chi kick. Popularized by Tai Chi of uh, Morning Glory Orphanage. Everyone knows this. I'll try to switch back to the bombs again. Actually, maybe I'll just do homing arrows, because I feel that, uh... At least that was causing guaranteed damage. Oh, the bombs are getting me better than anything else here. Nope. That was a bad run. That was a hard run on me. Stepping in bombs, taking every slash. Like, yes, that's how this is done. Wow, that was probably the worst time ever to use an arrow. I figure I'd just uh, shoot it out and then let the homing take care of itself, but not when I'm in the middle of a bomb and he started up another triple slash. Note to self, definitely get complete clearance. Dapping again! <laughs> Son of a bitch!
Nice. Was causing damage while I was away. You can't come up here, it's illegal. It's dirty pull, old man. That's my job. I mean, you're gonna let me. Goodness. Oh, my hands. <laughs> All right, Lair. What's so important that you, you put the worst dude in the world out here? Inaction declaration. Yeah, as I recall, this is his deal. <clears throat> my fellow Solarians, data corrupted. I would like to share not just the end of this journey with everyone, but the start of a new one. Ten years ago, we united to end the long night of the turbulent era and usher in the dawn of a new age, the origin era. Data corrupted. We once lost our way during the endless wars, but the rise of the Feng Shi Guild has brought peace to our lands. Following in its footsteps is our obsession with power and our technology, which have become our newest shackles. Data corrupted. We will be disbanding the Feng Shi Guild and sealing off all Feng Shi technology at the same time. Any technology deemed beneficial for all Solarians will be made common property for all to use. What? Impossible! All Feng Shi will collectively go into hiding. We will return to nature to seek the Tao's true essence. Returning to nature? Is he serious? Data corrupted. It belongs to every living being, every piece of land, and every drop of water. Today's decision may bring momentary turmoil, but I have faith that Data corrupted. Is he going to just let us go of our hard-fought gains? For the Tao often enacts through inaction. Data corrupted. In action? What does he mean? Lastly, no matter what the future may bring, please do not forget that we are all sojourners under this starry sky. What is this decision made? Why are we made not aware? Let us protect Peng Lai together and create a future that belongs to all Solarians. We need to find a way to get out of Kunlun.
Wow, this is whoa. A Dao fruit. Another Dao fruit. And a third Dao fruit. So these were the three sojourners. This is where they died. Yeah, Lear didn't die here, as we already know, because we went inside, because uh, we, we got our double jump. Lear kind of, like, what's the word? He friggin'... He, like, ascended or something. <laughs> he's, like, in the he's in the Fusong, and, like, he remains there long after his body is rotted away or whatever. The Rhizomatic Bomb. This ancient weapon can be handled over to Kuafu. This tiny bomb is capable of raising an entire island. It has been the final straw that broke the Jia Kingdom. It is remembered as the bringer of peace and an eternal stain on the Feng Shi Guild. And now we tap this, and maybe we can talk to Lair again. Yeah, when we got the double jump, we were basically talked to Lair, and he's like, Oh yeah, I'm just hanging out here now. My spirit's here. I don't know where my body is. Probably long gone. Hi, Lear. Hello, disciple. I'm glad I get to see you before I depart. Depart? Thought you couldn't return to the present world. My departure refers to a returning to the Great Tao. Ever since that idea emerged, my mind has been growing fainter. It might not be appropriate for me to say this, but I can't help but envy your lease. <laughs> I see the confusion in your heart has yet to dissipate. My time here is about to reach its end. Would you humor me and let me share you with a share with you a time worn fable? Of course, you have my undivided intention. Mm. Long, long ago, demonic spirits roamed the lands, putting people's lives in dire straits. Among them, a demonic dog, sympathizing with the plight of the people, decided to find the legendary demon slaying sword. Along the way, he gained three extraordinary partners an old snake spirit with unparalleled wisdom, a fearless tiger beast known for his boundless courage and a charismatic demon fox, known for her ability to charm any living creature. After countless trials and hardships, they finally retrieve the legendary sword. However, that's when this story takes a turn. They got rid of the demons, but peace did not prevail. <laughs> you are well learned, my friend. The old snake, caught up in the infinite ocean of knowledge, lost his way. The brave tiger, having forgotten their purpose, abused his power, and the beautiful fox, jealous of all the attention and love the dog received, slowly began to harbor wicked thoughts. They had become the new demon menaces, so the demonic dog had no choice but to dispose of his former comrades. However, as he cut them down one after the other, that's when it dawned on him. This only made him the most powerful demon alive. Do you think he made the right decision, fellow disciple? I... I don't know. Neither does this old fool. What is justice? Good and evil? Black and white? It all depends on the eye of the beholder. Before the great Tao, right or wrong may not matter at all. Are you that demonic dog? <laughs> Why couldn't it be you? Amidst this pitch black sky, we seek a sun that can illuminate the entire universe. But at what cost? What have we become? What am I supposed to do? Fret not. The answer is already in your heart. My time is up, ye. I must bid farewell. You know my name. Wait, I still have questions for you. Until next time, among the great Tao. Pity. How I would have loved to see Peng Lai once more. Cool. Yep. 
and there's nothing new here, right? Yeah. Alright, we are just about out of time, so what I'm going to do is head back to the pavilion, drop off this bomb, spend some skill points, and see what else I can... What other trouble I can cause around here. So, we wanted to go back up, which might be difficult in our current state. No, I think we can manage it. Surely we can manage this and not mess it up. Uh, that gets me... Yeah, yeah uh, but it might not get me close enough, that's all. Alright. Rope. Not rope. Eh. Climb. Yeah, that's right. What if I outrun you? Then what? Huh? 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 Yeah. Yeah. I have full tokes again, it's true. But, uh, yeah, I just wanted to get back. Because we've been at this for a while. Let's do our skills, which would be these. Power. Chi. And that leaves us with all our 3Bs, which, sure, I'll get on bounded charge. <laughs> Why not? And then we can do the rest of these. Hmm. And then we'll get an enhanced key blast and the two, and that'll call it. All right, back to the pavilion. Drop off this weird bomb thingy. Oh. Yep, that's true. I did get a healing as I technically used a node. It wasn't the node, but it was a node. Nope, nothing new to the boys. Look at them. Look look at all this cool stuff. He made, he made a kuafu. Oh, it's so cute. Oh, it's adorable. Now, I think I probably should point... Let me check just to make sure, but... I, I thought I'd got everything here. I do get everything here. Good. That's awesome. That's cleaned. The scripture area... The grotto scriptures is cleaned out. What up? So, kuafu. I got this weird bomb thing. No way! Rosomatic bomb? So they really do exist. Is it that infamous? You're the weird, you're the weird one for not knowing about it. This was a weapon that forced the GA Kingdom to surrender, and thereby put an end to the turbulent era. Why have I never heard about this? Probably because you're from the Shah. Taoists have always been reluctant to believe that Lear created such a weapon. Perhaps no one ever knew Lear for who he really was. So is it of any use? I'm gonna need more time to tinker with it. The rumors were even remotely credible. This bomb should be handled with extreme care. One tiny slip-up could level this entire pavilion. So that seems more like a story item than something I can purchase off him. As I'm assuming, getting into Lear's grave is kind of an optional, not really required to complete the story kind of thing. And, uh, <laughs> probably don't have much money. We have 86! <laughs> not much at all. No, indeed. All right. So, yeah. Awesome. That was good progress, and we completed the Grotto Scriptures completely. Beat G. Beat that dude in Mantelier's grave. So next up, we'll probably take on the Empyrean place. <laughs> so, great. We will pick this up on uh, Sunday evening, 5 p.m. Eastern Daylight Time. So for those of you who came by, as always, thank you so much for participating. Thanks for hanging out, and we'll see you next time.